Hello, Classy Class Class. I'm back again, and now we're going to discuss how to multiply whole numbers by fractions. So let's do go to our objective. I can multiply fractions by whole numbers and mixed numbers. So how do you multiply a whole number by a fraction? Well, what you do is you take the whole number times the numerator. So in this case, four times two is eight, and we keep the denominator. So four times two thirds equals eight thirds. I have a model here for you. So if you look at the model, we have four two thirds parts, and we can do it this way and we can add them together. So one third, two thirds, three thirds, four thirds, five thirds, six thirds, seven thirds, eight thirds. So four times two thirds equals eight thirds, or we can rename it to be two and two thirds. Next one we're gonna talk about is multiplying mixed numbers by whole number. Okay, so I have the example of five times two and two thirds. Our first step is to write two and two thirds as a fraction. Well, how do we write two and two thirds as a fraction? Well, we multiply the denominator by the whole number. So we take three, which is our denominator, times our whole number of two, and we get six. Then we add the product to the numerator. So our product of six plus two, our numerator, equals eight. And we can't keep the denominator, so we end up with eight thirds. The second step is to multiply five times eight thirds. So when we do that, we just take five times our numerator, which is eight, and we keep our denominator of three. So five times eight is 40, and we keep the denominator of three, so we have 40 thirds. And then our last step, which is step three, is to rename the fraction as a mixed number by dividing. So 40 divided by three equals 13 and one third. So we could, on the reverse side, to check our calculations, we can multiply three times 13, three times 13 is 39, and then we add our numerator one to get 40 thirds. So 13 and one thirds is equal to 40 thirds.